The building of structures has scarcely changed over the past 100 years, but it expends 32% of the world's resources in construction, consumes approximately 40% of global energy, and produces approximately 40% of total greenhouse gas emissions. At Monash University, we are developing new materials, modern construction techniques, and intelligent systems that will revolutionize the industry. Monash researchers have developed fibre-reinforced polymer and nano-composite materials for use in construction. Compared to traditional structural materials, they will lead to improved environmental impacts through their reduction in carbon dioxide emissions and embodied energy. These lightweight and high-strength materials can also be shaped into materials for prefabrication and rapid installation. We are also designing structural materials tailored for carrying load and providing thermal insulation, while considering the aesthetic like architectural features, transparency and self-luminance. Unlike most other industries, the construction industry is yet to adopt automated processes to speed up, optimise and economise production. Current practices still involve casting of concrete and welding of steel on site. The cumbersome scaffolding and formwork required to do this has increasingly unacceptable consequences in cost, quality and safety. Monash is at the forefront of developing modular construction technologies which will allow multi-storey buildings to be constructed and ready to live in in just a few days. Monash researchers are also using sensors and sensor technology to develop more efficient structural integrity systems. This research will deliver impacts on existing and next generation structural forms through embedded intelligence and inbuilt algorithms. Through our focus on advanced structural materials, smart modular construction technologies and intelligent structural systems, Monash is developing technologies that are expected to contribute to profound innovations and benefits in different economic, environmental and social levels.